I, Jordan, take you, Audra, to be my wife. This is my promise that I will commit myself to you and that you will always have my heart. No matter what you face in life, know that I will be right there with you, supporting you through your endless success and holding you steady through your trials. I promise to always share with you, care for you and communicate with you. I will always be proud of the amazing woman you are. I promise to always respect and honour you for all the days of my life. And I promise to always be your best friend. You are everything I could ever need and everything I could ever want. If I should live forever and all my dreams come true, none would be as great as the love I have for you. I give you my heart, my soul and my life to keep. I will always love you. I, Audra, take you, Jordan, to be my husband. Today I give you myself, my promise that I will love you all the days of my life. I promise to be your friend and partner every step of the way. I dedicate myself to your happiness, success and smile. I promise today to always stand by you, no matter what we face, to love and accept you exactly the way you are. I promise to always be proud of the man that you are and to always encourage you to pursue your hopes and dreams. I promise that my heart will forever be your shelter and my arms will be your home. I love you and our life together. I can't wait to see what the future brings. Jordan, you are to shelter Audra's life with protecting love, and you, Audra, are to wear your ring as the enclosing bond of reverence and faith in God, together fulfilling the perfect circle of unity that makes you one. And to both of you, I say, may your love for one another, your devotion and your faith be unending by the circles of these rings eternally. And those whom God has joined together, let no man set apart. And now, by the authority that's given to me in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, I have the greatest pleasure in declaring you to be husband and wife. Jordan, you may now kiss your beautiful bride. Standing here today feeling immensely proud and happy. But there's also a tinge of sadness as Audra's dad, Jamie, is not here with us today. Even though he's not with us, Audra and Jordan will be honouring him later by cutting the cake with his sword. Jamie would have been bursting with pride at seeing how beautiful our daughter is and thinking, I cannot believe our fairy is getting married. Congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. Saville. Who would have ever thought our fairy would be getting married one day as well? Jordan, I think you're just perfect for Audra. I think we all agree. You're both so creative. You truly love spending time together. And you fit in so well with Audra's family and friends. But the main reason that I know, Jordan, that you're perfect for Audra is the sound of her voice every time she answers the phone or when I speak to her. We make a perfect pair while maintaining our independence and I can't wait for all the more love we'll share for the rest of our lives. And just in case anyone hasn't noticed, I'd like to point out how unbelievably beautiful and gorgeous my wife looks tonight. Yeah. 